The presentation on lobular breast cancers will really focus on our uh, recent paper uh, coming from the Cancer Genome Atlas Project, uh, which was focused on lobular breast cancers. And uh, from those studies, the, really the main finding was uh, strong reinforcement that on a molecular level, lobular breast cancer is really a distinct disease and has, uh, of course, a unique set of mutations, most prominently including e uh but also another interesting finding of enrichment for mutations in a, in a gene called FOXA1. Uh, we also then, through gene expression profiling, found three potential uh, expression subtypes of lobular breast cancer, uh, one of which showed a more proliferative phenotype and had a, a slightly worse prognosis than the other two. Uh, the other two were really defined by unique features of the microenvironment. In, in, and in one case, it looked like there was immune cell infiltrates. Uh, and in the other case, it looked like maybe they were fibroblasts or, or, or other types of stromal cell uh, infiltrates. Right? And so, suggesting that there are important interactions between the tumor and the microenvironment and, and, and maybe you know, certainly for the immune cell type uh, or the immune infiltrated type, maybe we could target that with some of these uh, uh, immunotherapies. 